Hey, what's up, y'all? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Kiana Shaquille. If you're new here, make sure you subscribe below, comment below, like this video, like my old videos, share with somebody you know. Share with your uncle, brother, sister, cousin, niece, nephew, sister, any and everybody. Everybody you know, share with them. So today we're gonna get into a beginner-friendly glitter um, eyeshadow tutorial. You're real easy, real simple. Anybody can do this. So we're gonna do that and that's really pretty much it. I hope you all enjoy this video. I hope you like this video, share with somebody you know, and just continue to tune in. Subscribe to the channel if you wanna see more hair videos, makeup videos, vlogs, and me walking in my faith, and me walking in my purpose with God and everything, just me living my life. Subscribe to the channel. So yeah, let's get into this makeup video. what's up y'all let's get into this eyeshadow look i hope y'all excited like i'm excited but let's get into it i'm gonna take this palette right here and i'm gonna take that brown and i'm gonna pack it all over my brush and i'm going to put that brown and the top of my eyelid like you see me doing and i'm going to continue to build it up until i get the desired shade on my eye that i'm that i'm going for but with this look you can always use different colors you don't have to use the exact same colors that i'm using but this is just an easy beginner friendly way to do a glitter eyeshadow look so I hope y'all enjoy the video. I hope y'all continue to stay tuned. Give this video a thumbs up. Comment below. Let me know what other videos you want to see me do. And continue to stay tuned. And like you see me doing, I'm doing the same exact thing on the next eye as well. So y'all just continue to stay tuned, y'all. I'm trying to talk a little more on my videos. So that's why I decided to do a voiceover on this video. Because I know y'all don't want to continue to just listen to music throughout the whole entire makeup video. We're going to get into a voiceover on this makeup video. So I'm going to take my next palette and I'm going to use that color right there. And you're going to see me pack that in the middle of my eyelid and kind of right on top of that shade as well so i can get everything blend in together nicely my it look a little blurry right here on the camera but i promise you it's going to clear up in a second but i'm going to continue to put that right in the middle of my eyelid and on top of that first shade that i used and blend it in all together nicely like you see me doing y'all i really enjoy doing makeup and i hope y'all enjoy watching me do makeup as well like i enjoy doing it so i guess we can get it into a couple of makeup tips until i go to the next shade i think the most most important thing to get a flawless makeup look is to make sure you're doing your skin prep make sure you prepping this skin so your foundation won't look all cakey and everything just won't look like it's sitting on top of each other. Do that skin prep <laughs> and then everything else will blend together nicely. And right here you see me cutting my crease. I'm using a light shade concealer to cut the crease because I want that um, eyeshadow that I'm using to show up real, real bright. So I'm using a lighter concealer to cut the crease but that's really what i'm doing right now i'm cutting the crease not all the way out to the corner of my eyelid because i'm not going for a wing glitter look but i'm doing just a little um cut crease because like i said it is beginner friendly and after i cut the crease to the desired to the desired length that i'm going for i make sure i blend it in with my concealer brush as well make sure you blend it in make sure you put a little bit of powder on it as well because you don't want your concealer to move and you don't want your eyeshadow to move so yeah that's really what i did and you see when i i like to start when i cut the crease i like to place the concealer at the bottom of my eyelid just a little bit at the bottom and i like to look up and that helps me get the perfect crease so that's another tip that y'all can use as well. Start at the bottom and then work your way to the top because you don't want your crease to be too big and you don't want your crease to be too small. So work in small motions when you're trying to cut your crease. Some more makeup tips like I was saying about skin prep. 
make sure you get you a good skincare routine going down you don't need all that complex stuff you need you a good um face cleanser you need you a good toner good um, moisturizer and a good sunscreen wear your sunscreen i cannot stress it enough sunscreen changed my whole entire face get you a good sunscreen i use black girl sunscreen you can give that a try but what works for me won't work for you but i love that sunscreen as well now i'm just taking a dark brown shade and blending it in a little more because when i cut the crease it did kind of go away a little bit so i want that brown to show up a little more so i added more to it and i also went in and fixed the corner of my eye because you don't want your crease to look all messed up and all lopsided so make sure you go in and fix any mistakes that you make and if you do make mistakes it's okay because you can always fix it like you see me fixing my mistake that i made but again, I hope y'all enjoying this video. Make sure you subscribe to my channel. Subscribe to my homegirl, Jerry L. channel as well. The link gonna be in the description box. And just continue to enjoy the video. Okay, now I'm taking this palette right here and I'm taking this dark brown and mixing it with this light brown as well. And I'm gonna take that and put it at the outer corner of my eyes. Y'all, I seen that TikTok video where they was talking about makeup artists using almost every shade of eyeshadow in the eyeshadow palette. And sometimes they don't even know what color they use. I don't know, I thought that was funny, especially when I started doing this video. That was too funny to me. But now I'm taking this white color and I'm going to put that all where I'm going to put the glitter at all over my eyelid and I'm gonna do it for the next one as well I think I had to switch my brushes out if y'all seen me switch my brushes I had to switch them out I didn't like how that brush was putting all the white on my eyelid I wanted to be more vibrant look so I switched my brushes out so I'm just gonna do that all over and top all over my eyelid y'all don't judge the look right now wait until um y'all see the look come together i'm telling you it's gonna be so so cute super cute super easy anybody can do this look it's very beginner friendly and if you want to skip the um white eyeshadow part you're welcome to do that but i find that it makes the glitter pop a little more oh that's why i'm doing the white eyeshadow before i put the glitter on but again thank you all for watching thank you for tuning in i hope you give this video a thumbs up give me a comment below let me know what other videos you want to see me do make sure you go subscribe to my homegirl jerry l channel again the link is in the description box the link for her channel is in the description box go subscribe to my homegirl channel y'all <laughs> but I love how this look came out. I can't wait till y'all see how it came out. And I'm also going to take that brush that I used for the brown and I'm going to blend the white into it. So everything can blend into it. So everything can blend together nicely. And I'm also going to take that silver. I really don't like how it was showing up because I needed a more silver eyeshadow instead of more of a little glitter gold kind of eyeshadow. So I really don't like how they was showing up. But if you have a more silver um, glitter looking eyeshadow, use that. But I really don't have one. I need to go get one. If y'all can recommend me one, comment below and let me know. But I put that all over my eyelid as well. Okay, y'all, now it's time for the fun part. Putting this glitter all over my eyelid. If y'all love glitter as much as I love glitter, Give this video a thumbs up. And the glue that I'm using is this lash glue. Y'all, I love using this glue to put my glitter on more than I like the original glue that I used to use because it's time to take everything off. All you have to do is use whatever you're using to take your makeup off with, press it into your eye with a paper towel or something, however you take your makeup off. You press it into your eye and it comes off so, so easily to make a complete mess. But, and I'm also using this brush and I put some lash glue on the brush as well. And I sprinkle my glitter on top of it and I pack the glitter all over my eyelid like you see me doing. 
again thank y'all for watching this video thank you for tuning in um i hope you give this video a thumbs up give me a comment below comment below let me let me know what other videos you want to see me do comment below and let me know what you think of this video and just thank y'all for watching and make sure y'all subscribe to the channel if you haven't subscribed to the channel and you're watching this video what's going on what's up with you <laughs> no nah, but i did the same exact thing to my other eye as well and before the video over another makeup tip i can give you all is blush invest in you a good blush blush took my makeup to the next level i know i probably said this in a video before but i'm serious i used to didn't wear blush and blush took my makeup to the next 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 level like seriously so get y'all a blush and like you see me do before i took the brush that i used the dark brown on and i added to the corner of my eye with a glitter and the eyeshadow meat just so i can get a more flawless look that can look on the cord and now i'm going to put my lashes on y'all i seen this tiktok video i'm always seeing tiktok videos of makeup hacks and things like that so i seen this tiktok video where this girl said she put her lashes on an easy way is by doing what i'm doing putting the mirror down below and looking at looking down below and putting your lashes on like that and I will tell you that it worked for my first lash. As you can see, I'm putting it on real, real easy, real fast. But the second one, it was real, real stubborn. So I guess this makeup had counter work, <laughs> I guess you can say. But I think I just put it on. I think I just put my lashes on the regular way. But again, thank y'all for watching this video. Thank you for tuning in. Subscribe to the channel. Give me a like. Comment below. Go subscribe to my homegirl channel as well. And I'm out. Okay, y'all, this is the finished look. My camera might look a little creaky. I gotta get this together, but it's okay. But this is the finished look. Thank y'all for watching. Thank you for tuning in. If you like this video, give this video a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. Make sure you check the description box as well to click the link to subscribe to Jerry L channel as well. Thank y'all for watching. Thank you for tuning in. Like this video, don't like my old videos. Go watch my old videos as well. And let's get into the beat. And I'm out.